I think what's happening with our Hello Kittens uh, viewers, letting people know I'm in here, so uh, no, it's only hear a strange voice and freak out. I think what's happening to Matilda is what happened to Mo when I had him. She's got something upsetting with her tummy. Where they, they quickly pass it. Poor kiddo. I don't want to get food just yet, but I'm going to syringe her some water. That's what helped Mo a lot. Be back. Kiddo, let's see if this settles your stomach a little bit. She's purring. Hey, honey, you want to come watch? Make, make her feel better too seeing me. Now in Matilda's case, she feels a little down right afterwards, but she still plays, still very active. Which is yeah, a good sign. <laughs> She's so laid back, it's crazy. Okay. This is just water. Let's see if it'll help settle her stomach. And also to help her keep her from dehydrating. Just being mostly cautious now. If it, her throwing up frequently is a concern, but rushing her to the vet or anything like that won't really solve anything right now. A lot of times it's just a quick, short bug that they quickly fight off. She's healthy, she's active. And plus, kittens that are over two pounds are very stable.
Packers. You like that? Poor kiddo. I'm getting a bath. Let's see how she does with a little bit of water. Enjoy the kittens. Have a nice day. Up in the litter box. Oh, come here, girl. Let me clean that up. Well, if you're going to throw it up, the litter box is the best place for it. Interesting note. I see a lot of kittens throwing up in the litter box. I'm going to wait till her sessions are farther apart before giving her more water or food. This is just how Moe was when he got sick. So he was a lot worse off than Matilda. I'm going to wait till the sessions spread out a little more. And then give water. I'm keeping a close eye on her. She's in good hands. Sorry, Matilda. Matilda seems to be sleeping peacefully. Not sure if I said that already. I'm going to leave her be. 